Good morning, Westbrook kids. We miss you and we hope to see you soon. I hope you had a terrific Easter and saw all the Easter greetings from teachers at the end of last week's video. Do you remember our theme this month? It's bloom. Flowers and trees are all getting ready to bloom, which is a sign of being alive and reminds us of our big question of the month. Who is alive? Jesus is alive. Let's stand up and sing and dance before we head to the clubhouse with Ollie to hear more about Jesus. God loves us and he gave his only son. He is awesome.
Oh, I hope they've bloomed, I hope they've bloomed. Hi friends, I'm Kai. My friends and I planted flowers in our flower pots and have been waiting and waiting for them to bloom. I think today's the day, but I'm afraid to look and see. Maybe there are so many flowers that I won't even be able to walk in the clubhouse. That might be too many flowers. Maybe the flowers have grown so big and tall that they're hitting the top of the clubhouse. That might be too tall for a flower. <sighs> okay, here I go, it's time to look. Do you wanna look with me? Cover your eyes and count to three with me. Go ahead, cover your eyes. Now let's count to three. One, two, three. Wow, oh wow, they bloomed and they're perfect. Not too many and not too tall, they're just right. These are absolutely perfect. Do you know why? My grandma has a spot on her windowsill that will be just right for these flowers. Who? Who? It's Ollie. Hello, Kai. Who? Who? What beautiful flowers. I love that blue. I'm gonna give them to my grandma when I have breakfast at her house. What a wonderful breakfast for you. I know about another special breakfast, too. So let's hear this story. Just follow me through. Hoo, hoo. Follow me through, follow me through, hoo. Ollie's got a Bible story for me and you. <laughs> okay, guys, great walk today. Now it's time for breakfast. <laughs> oh, hi, friends. <laughs> you guys say hello. <laughs> Hi, I'm Carrie, and this is my best dog, Stormy Jane, and her friends, Barkley and Goldie. We've been out on a long walk today, and everyone is hungry. Do you like breakfast? <laughs> Me too. Do you like to eat waffles? Do you like cereal? Do you like fish? Some people have fish for breakfast, just like the people in today's true story from the Bible. Today, we're going to talk about what happened after Easter. Easter started out sad. Jesus died and was put in a tomb. But did he stay in there? No, he came back just like he said he would. Jesus is alive. Jesus is alive. Well, not long after that, some of Jesus' friends were fishing when all of a sudden, they saw Jesus standing on the beach. Jesus is alive. They were so excited to see him. Show me your excited face. Ready? <laughs> yes, the disciples were so excited. And Jesus told his friends to come and have breakfast with them right there on the beach. They were so happy to be with their good friend Jesus again and they knew that he loved them and that he would always be their friend forever and ever. And do you know what? Jesus loves you so much and he wants to be your friend too, forever and ever. How awesome is that? Jesus is alive and he wants to be your friend forever. Hey there, Ollie. Ollie, tell me, who is alive? Jesus is alive. Yes, it's true. Now let's hear it from you. Tell me, who is alive? Jesus is alive. That's the truth, friends. You better believe it. Bye. <laughs> so there's your story, and it's all true. Jesus is alive, and he wants to be your friend forever, too. Thanks, Ollie. Goodbye to you. Who? Who? Wow, Jesus came back just like he said he would. Then he had breakfast with his friends and told them he wants to be their friend forever. I think I got the story. Did you get it? If you did, say got it. Get it? Got it! Good. I can't wait to give my flowers to my grandma at breakfast. I can tell her that Jesus is alive and that he ate breakfast with his friends too. Ooh, I hope grandma's gonna make pancakes and bacon, yum! I am alive forever.
and ever. Revelation 1.18. I am alive forever and ever. Revelation 1.18. Who is alive? Jesus is alive. And what is our memory verse? I'm alive forever and ever. Revelation 1.18. Wow, isn't it great that after Jesus died, he was alive and invited his friends to have breakfast with him. They knew Jesus loved them and he would always be their friend. Jesus loves you too and wants to be your friend forever and ever. This week, have a picnic inside or outside with your family and talk about Jesus. Adults, if you're new to Westbrook Kids and you'd like to get connected with our children's ministry online events or newsletter, please email us at info at westbrook.church. We would love to have you as part of Westbrook Kids and also remember to always check our Westbrook Kids Facebook page. Thanks for worshiping with us today.